What's up, Pisces, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of my beautiful Pisces out there are doing well. So, Pisces, this is going to be a no-contact reading. I got several dates out here. We're going to pull some messages, and we're going to see what this person wants to say to you, okay? What does this person want you to know that you are no longer in contact with, all right? So, if anything resonates for you guys, go ahead and like this video, comment, subscribe to my channel, and hit that notification bell. So, the first card we have here is Big Ego, okay? So, Pisces, this person wants you to know that they realize that they had a big ego. This person knows now, they're recognizing now, that they were operating in this ego, okay? So, this could have been someone that could have been, like, very unapologetic. This is someone that didn't like to take accountability, you know, because they felt like they can do whatever they wanted to do and... You know, it didn't matter because they did. They the man. They the woman. You know what I'm saying? So they can just do and, you know, treat you however they wanted to. And they feel like you always is going to be there. Okay? So for some of you, this person saying that they, they realize they were operating out of ego. Okay? They realize that the way they handled this situation, that they were operating out of this big ego that they had. Okay? Then we have... I don't want to give you what you deserve. Yeah, because this person was operating out of ego. So when you was dealing with this person, why you guys have been in separation, this person realizes that they have a big ego and this person did not want to give you what you deserve. Okay, so this person realized that you deserve the best Pisces. This person knew what they had. All right, but this person, like I said, they fumbled the ball. The, they fumbled the ball and this person didn't want to give you what they deserve. Or what you deserve. Okay, but this person wants to apologize for that, okay? So while you guys have been in separation, okay, this person has been thinking about it. They want to apologize for having this be ego, okay? For not taking accountability for your feelings. For not thinking about how their actions will make you feel, okay? This person wants to apologize for not giving you what you deserved in this relationship, this commitment, this marriage, this friendship, whatever it was. And while you guys have been in separation, this person has been sitting there waiting to hear from you, Pisces, and you tell me why. In the hell, Pisces, this person gonna be sitting there pretty waiting from you, or waiting to hear from you when they the ones that mess up. Ain't that crazy how people do that? Someone to sit here and do something to you and then be waiting for you to reach out to them and be like, oh, well, I was just texting to see if you was ready to apologize. Like, no, that's not how they go. If you mess up, you apologize to me. You let me know you're sorry for doing what you did, right? Okay. My bad, you guys. I got a little heated for a second. Let's bring it on down. Whew. All right. What does this person need my Pisces to know at this time? What do they want to say to my Pisces? What's this person that's on my Pisces mind? What do they want to say to my Pisces here? What do they want them to know at this time? Okay. So this person has been reminiscing about you guys since you have been in separation, since you guys have not been in communication, okay? Because this person is reminiscing and they like, man, I had a good thing when I had Pisces. And it was like, I fun with the ball. Like, I fun with their heart. I fun with the ball. Like, they're reminiscing. And I feel like kicking themselves in their own behind because they're realizing, you know, they messed up. <laughs> what did I say? This person thinks the world of you. Yeah, this person realized that they had, like, the best thing ever, Pisces, and, and they think the world of you, okay? So since you guys have been in, in, in no contact, this person wants you to know they think the world of you, Pisces. They think you like the best thing since sliced bread, baby. Okay, then we have, there was someone interfering with our relationship. Okay, so Pisces, this person wants you to know. That there was someone that was interfering in this relationship, okay? So this could have been another reason why this person couldn't give you, or they didn't want to give you what you deserved at this time, okay? Because maybe this person had to end another relationship here, okay? So we, if we got time, we're going to clarify that card. Let's pull a couple more messages here. So for some of you guys, if you were wondering, was there a third party or someone else that interfered in your connection? Yes, it was. So they just told you right there, okay? What else does this person need? Ooh, man, they didn't give me a chance. Yep, ooh, look at this, you guys. There was a third party that interfered. There was someone that interfered with y'all connection, Pisces, and this person gave in to that temptation, okay? So that could have been someone just came in and tempted this person. They could have been out and about, you know, with their friends, with their females one night, and they seen this, this little thing, this little shoulder, you know what I'm saying? They pulled up on them and they rolled with it, you know what I'm saying? So for some of you guys, this person, they, you know what I'm saying? If you were in a relationship, this person possibly could have cheated or they gave in to some type of temptation, what messages do you have for my Pisces today, Spirit? What does this person need them to know at this time? What does this person want my Pisces to know? Okay, so this person is saying they're grateful for their spiritual lessons, okay? But some of you guys, this talks about a spiritual connection that you had with this person, okay? So I feel like you walking away from this person, that was the biggest lesson that this person had to learn, okay? They had to learn that you don't treat people any type of dog in a way and think they're going to stand around 
and let you do that, okay? For some of you guys, could have been someone that hid behind material things. I think cancer just had this too, so you guys could be dealing with a cancer here. But this is someone who hid behind material things, okay? They hid behind the labels, and you know, they was a label holder. They like to write their Yeezys and their Jordans and whatever, all the expensive labels were, okay? This is what they felt what made them, okay, when people saw them, they wanted them to be like, oh, this, you know what I'm saying, this mother wasn't the nicest clothes and stuff like that, but they hear who they truly were, okay, this person wore a mask, or you guys, go check out that cancer video if you're dealing with the cancer, but this person saying that you were the best thing of their life, yeah, because they saying you, they think the world of you, you were the best thing in this person's life, Pisces, and they messed up, they fumbled the ball, baby. They hid behind material things, they didn't want to give you what you deserve, then they sitting up here waiting for you, to call them back. Like, what type of stuff is that? Let's go to this Kipper deck. Whew. What messages do you have for my Pisces today, Spirit? What is this person that they are no longer in contact with? What does this person want them to know at this time? Messages for my Pisces. What does this person need my Pisces to know at this time? All right, Pisces. So this person is putting an end to something, okay? So while you guys have not been in, in communication, this person has ended something. They ended some type of cycle. They've ended some type of relationship or some type of marriage. Remember we had, there was a third party situation, okay? Or someone interfered with their relationship. So whoever interfered with you guys' relationship, this person has put an end to that situation, okay? Get this person realizing that you were the best thing in their life. So how they gonna sit up here and be dealing with this third party when you the best thing that they ever had? All right, Pisces, for some of you guys, you about to you about to have some sudden wealth, okay? For some of you, this for you, Pisces. <laughs> this message is for you guys, okay? This person feel like they hit the jackpot when it came for you. And some of you, Pisces, hey, you may be getting ready to have some sudden wealth here, all right? One more card for my Pisces. Yeah, make sure I'm looking at this. Okay, let's see what signs you guys are dealing with. So I'll pull one more card here. What signs are my Pisces dealing with here? All right, Pisces. We have Capricorn. We have Gemini. We have Gemini and we have Scorpio. Okay, so let's get... No, that'll be it. All right, Pisces. If that's all I have for you guys, if anything resonates, please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Stay blessed, Pisces, and I love you.